morning, we're supposed to hear from Attorney General Curtis Hill about the investigation into the thousands of fetal remains that were found at the home of an abortion doctor. Alyssa has been following this story for us. And Alyssa, do we know what he is planning to talk about today? Well, that press release on this was super short and didn't give any specific details. All it did say was that Attorney General Curtis Hill would be holding a press conference at 11 a.m. to talk about the investigation into Dr. Ulrich Kloffer's Indiana abortion clinics and other properties. In case you missed it, more than 2,200 men medically preserved remains were found on his property in Illinois days after he died. Investigators don't believe the abortions were performed there. Instead, they believe those abortions occurred here in Indiana between 2000 and 2002. And just yesterday, police searched Cloffer's former offices in both Fort Wayne and South Bend, but didn't find any more remains. So I can tell you in the 31 years that I've been doing this job, I've never seen anything like this ever. It is, it is a strange, you know, it's one of those once-in-a-lifetime things. The AG's office here in Indiana is looking to see if appropriate disposal was conducted and review of medical records was conducted as well. But since the doctor has died, they said that there are few choices for criminal charges. Of course, that's a question for Attorney General Curtis Hill, and we'll be asking that today at this press conference at 11 a.m. All right. Thank you, Alyssa. Well,